Greetings, you too. Danny State here on the Danny Dan blog. I'm Beep of the Woods, near Spivey Point, near Winston, South Carolina. I'm very near school. Up here on this little trail that comes down through the woods, where they have these power poles separating the area. And I call it the Bigfoot Highway, because Bigfoots and Dogmen, I think, use that power pole area. Where it's all clear to travel up and down through the state, undetected, basically. Just after this morning, some kids coming from a school said they saw large hairy creatures in the woods. Right where the hell I'm standing. Yes, it's true. I'm on the scene of the crime, so to speak. And I had been in the woods about five minutes. You can see the other video on the Danny Staten channel. And I'd been in the woods about five minutes when I found this. That's right, a weird-ass tree structure. I see so many weird things in the woods. And I always try to... Ah, oh, damn, it's slippery. Ah, I always try to get them on camera for you guys. So check this one out. What do you think about this weird-ass tree thing? Is this natural? Let me know in the comments below. I want to put a special shout-out to my friend Long Island Bigfoot Mike. This is your kind of stuff. You're the expert to me on tree structures and weirdness. So take a look at this, Long Island Mike. Be sure to let me know in the comments below if they show up what you think. I've been having trouble because I did a comic book video recently. And when I put it up, it said no comments could be left. And I did not do that. It did it to itself. Fuck you, YouTube. I don't know why you do that to me. Anyway, I want to get this tree structure on video real quick before I continue my investigation. As I'm in the area where the kids said they saw large hairy creatures, three of them running through the woods. I saw some pretty disturbed land in the leaves earlier. You can see that video on the day's dating show. I suddenly just urged to shut the fuck up. Several large trees down in this area. I have a tendency to believe what these kids said to be true. As I've been in this area a few times on investigations, I'm very near a place called Spivey Point where I did a video called The Werewolves of Williamston. You can find that video here on the Daily Dan blog if you want to go back and check it out. I wonder if this stuff's been placed here to kind of make a choke point, like you were hunting deer. You'd push them up into here and they couldn't get by and you could ambush them a lot better. Jesus. As always, YouTube, be sure to let me know in the comments below if you see anything. The Daily Dan misses. You know, since I got here today, I've been having this real uneasy feeling. It's, it's just weird. It's, I don't know if it's because it's like 40 degrees out here and freaking freezing. That's why I'm so shaky or not. If there's just something weird going on. I can't tell where it's coming from, but I keep hearing the sounds of something trashing through the leaves. gone now, but that was some freaky shit. I'm gonna head off in that direction down there where I just heard sound like something walking through the leaves. See if I can put eyes on whatever the hell it was.
I don't know if that picked up on the camera, but I just heard what sounded like a whistling noise. But it was not in my immediate area. Oh, Jesus, it's a briar tree. wonder if I can get through the briar tree. I made it, yay! Even though I've been close to here, the area I'm standing in right this second is one of them areas I have not been in before, so I'll have to travel a little slower and a little more cautious. Well, that's something that's peculiar. Hmm. I'm gonna have to go check that out real quick. To my left over here. Yeah. Check this out, YouTube. An incredible pile of stones. Out here in the middle of the woods. All piled up for weirdness. I don't know why. Maybe this used to be like an old house foundation. Or a, what they used to call a cellar maybe. I see I watched this channel called the Green Mountain Metal Detecting. And he's finding these rock structures very similar to this one. Which tend to be old sailors, sellers of houses from back in the day. He metal detects them and finds coins and stuff around them. Maybe the Daily Dam will have to come back out here one day in the summertime when it's not freezing. And metal detect this area. Does it not be some kind of old ship? Heard something. Some type of old shelter area. What do you know, YouTube? What do you think? Look how flat that one is. Almost shaped wood. Be sure to let me know in the comments below. If they show up where you can actually leave comments. Because we know how YouTube is. And what you think that might be. There's some bottles out here. Obviously some homeless people or something has been using this area as a party zone. Huh. It's still very interesting. Oh, I found a field of briars. Oh, I wish I could get through this without getting all stuck the hell up. Uh, maybe I'll transmute around this side of it. That field right there looks like it'd be a real pain in the ass to try to go through. What do you think, YouTube? I'll tell you what, YouTube. I think Danny's going to call it a... Let's call it on this video. And I'll pick it up on another video when I get through this mountain of briars because I don't want to spend five minutes on video trying to get through some damn briars. You know what I mean? So this is Danny Staten on the Danny Dan Blog. Be sure to like, subscribe, and ring the bell. Be sure to join me on my further adventures as I investigate kids. Seeing our creatures in the woods in Williamstown, South Carolina. Till next time, Danny Staten saying, blog over dudes, blog over.